Hello, welcome to Honda Brainos. In this tutorial, I want to inform you that Honda K Crypto community has added two testnet tasks, Fuel Lab and Venom. And in this particular tutorial, I will be showing you how to engage in Fuel Labs testnet task to qualify for potential token airdrop. Fuel Lab is already very huge and people are talking about it and they have raised a substantial amount of money. Just like other projects, they have the main task and they have their ecosystem applications that are built on them. Currently, almost all the applications on Fuel is not yet functional or usable, except one, the Sway Swap, which we are going to try out, right? So to begin this, we will have to download Fuel Wallet. From the spreadsheet, uh, there is this first instruction here. Uh, because they are still under development, their wallet can be downloaded and imported to your wallet extension. You cannot install it the normal way. And that's this part one. So turn on developer mode from your Chrome extension page. Let's do that. At the right top, you will see developer mode. I'm going to turn it on. Now, after that, come to the second one, which is to download the wallet. Just click on the link. Meanwhile, these links will be in the description. In case you are not a subscribed member of 100k crypto community, don't worry, you will have this description in the video, right? So when you click on that link, you are able to download the wallet. Alternatively, you could go to fuel.network and click on experience fuel the first thing launch the app and it will prompt you to install the wallet you can see now let's download the wallet you are going to download the wallet to your device right after you have downloaded the wallet uh, you need to extract it it is zipped so extract it and you are able to go back to your extension page okay and click on load unpacked and import the one you have extracted or you could just drag it and drop it here drag it from that folder and drop it here so let me use this method load unpacked i already extracted the wallet let me find it the one i extracted you can see four wallets right this is it and select now you have to create a new wallet okay don't do this with your existing airdrop wallet that has real money create a new wallet i'll click on create a wallet the wallet you are going to create now you are going to use it uh, both for this uh, one and also you are going to use the same new wallet you, you created for venom right the next video will be on venom of course, I have exposed my private key, which should not be. So let me just cancel and refresh this page to generate another set of private keys or recovery phrases. I have copied your, your recovery phrases and given it back correctly. Then you have to, of course, speak passwords. You know this uh, method already. And we have our wallet. Maybe let me pin it to the top. So wallet is created successfully. Now go to the next link in the description or the next link in the spreadsheet, which is this link. So let's click on it to get some file sets. Connect your wallet. And then you will get some file set it. Give me if. Add asset, just follow the line, follow the instructions. So we're gonna get all these assets. Mint assets. I have read and understand the legal terms. So click on it to move to swapping. So this is the 
only app currently that is working on fuel labs let me check my wallet you will see i have 0 0.4 each so now and also i have this die as it so just do swap in here you already know how to do that i can see i have 500 die here so let me let me just swap some die so i will be swapping 50 die to s it you could swap anything you want any amount just try out the app It is done. You can see my money has reduced by fifty dollars. So let me do the reverse, which is swapping like zero point zero one. okay the next one will be to try to provide liquidity so let let me click on pool so let's throw in 50 die against this s it and click on add liquidity approve it was added successfully let me view it on on the explorer okay successful so that's good. Let me remove some liquidity. Um, let me just remove 0 0.001. So that's it. You have done the main part. The next part will be to always watch out for the apps on Fuel App. So Fuel.Build. I'm going to put this in this spreadsheet. These are the apps built on Fuel. A lot of them are, almost all of them are not usable now, but they are building. So as they get available, we'll keep on updating our spreadsheets, right, for you to, you know, test. So I will add, I will add that link to Fuel.Build in the spreadsheet. That's just that for Fuel Lab. The next video will be on Venom Network, which is another big project. I will see you in the next video.